after all. Oh, don't get caught up. <laughs> you had a little baby since you were last oh, here. Yeah, you know, I was just standing back there and I was thinking about the last time I was here. Mm -hmm. And you know how they say women have a, you know, intuition about being pregnant? Yeah. Well, when I was standing back there last time, I felt really nauseous and I thought, is this just because I'm nervous? Or... And I, I'm pregnant. And I was. I was pregnant. It was unbelievable. And, and you... Yeah, back... and I realized it right there. <laughs> wow. <laughs> So, did you name the baby Arsenio? No. Uh, you know what? Did you think of anything before you came out tonight? <laughs> did anything go through Actually, I thought you were pregnant. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> uh oh. Uh, <laughs> rabbit kiss. Um, no, I hope not. I, and I hope no one I know is pregnant. <laughs> oh, um, okay, let's, let's switch gears. You're a very serious subject. Article 99 is the name. Yeah. And you tell us what the plot is. Well, it's a serious subject, but we deal with it in a, in a kind of funny way. It's, it's an exciting movie because it's about um, the VA hospitals mm -hmm. and about a lot of the, the terrible things that are going on there. And I play part of a renegade band of doctors, which includes Ray Liotta and Kiefer Sutherland and Forrest Whitaker and John McGinley. It's a great cast. Wow, good actors. Yeah, yeah, they're great actors and they're funny. And it's really an exciting group to be with because... It's really a great movie if you're, you know, if you're pissed off about what's going on in this country, if you're angry about, you know, being afraid of health care and... I think we are. Yeah, yeah. And I'm mad about Leona calling us little people. <laughs> that's no, right. No, but that's I think right. everybody's angry. I think yeah. that's, you know, why people are voting for Buchanan. Yeah, well, this movie, it's got a real up message and, and it's like the people, the people win. And um, it's, it's dealing with a lot of frustration and also our vets, which we're not taking care of properly. Mm. And so it's kind of got a message, but it's not too tough that way, you know? It's not like medicine, you know? Isn't there, a, like, a frightening amount of veterans that are homeless? Yeah, yeah. One-third of all homeless men are, are vets, which is terrible. It's just terrible. And, and the weird thing was is they were kicking some, some homeless vets out from the underpass by Wadsworth, yeah. and they, they said they'd rather live there than in the hospital. Are the hospitals that Yeah, bad? some of them. Some of them are good, but... Did you go for research to check them out? Yeah, I did. We, we got kicked out of some hospitals, too, when they found out that we were with the movie. Yeah. So, yeah. We saw a lot of bad things. Where does the title come from? Um, well, Article 99 is a fictitious, uh, kind of like a catch-22, which means that if you're a vet, you're entitled to, to medical care, but it has to be service-related. So it's kind of a, a strange thing that, that nobody quite understands. Yeah. So it's a catch-22. Um, did you talk to a lot of veterans? Yeah, I did. And we had a lot of great screenings where there were a lot of vets in the audience. And we actually had vets that were extras on the movie. And they loved the movie. They, it was really exciting because they were cheering and they were going, you tell them, Ray, you tell them, Leah. You know, they were like screaming at the, the screen. And they really appreciate that we're trying to tell their story and stick up for them. God, you got Ray and Forrest. You got all these guys in the same movie. What, what's in the clip you brought? Um, well, this, I'm a doctor, um, kind of, I've been around, and I'm trying to tell um, Kiefer, I'm telling him off, you know, I'm saying, like, wake up, smell the coffee, look around. Yeah. And he's a new doctor. Okay, let's look at the clip. Sandy, you got it cute, babe? Hey, wait a second. I gotta talk to you. What is it? Do you have a problem with me? Is it my work or something? No, I think you'll make a very good doctor. I was wondering maybe maybe we could have a cup of coffee or something sometime. I don't think so. Why is it every time you look at me, you look as though I've got something you're afraid to catch? I could never catch what you've got. You know, maybe it's just what you need. Look. I've seen hot shots like you come and go with your frat house grins and your option on a suite of fancy offices. All you have to do is stop by here for a couple years and... Practice up on some poor, beaten-down bastards who can't go to a malpractice attorney every time you screw up. Have you ever bothered to take a real look at the men in these rooms? Or stop to figure out what's really going on here? Or am I stupid to think that it could possibly matter to someone like you? Um. They shot you kind of high. Yeah. <laughs> I got a lot of close-ups. 
Yeah. Yeah, because I was pregnant. <laughs> How many months can that be? Seven. Pregnant. Woo! <laughs> <laughs> and actually, um, the man shooting you is the man that got you pregnant. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Well, not exactly the director, yeah. 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 <laughs> did, you, did you have a lot of morning sickness? Uh, no, no, not really. I, I was pretty lucky that way. I had kind of afternoon sickness, but uh, <laughs> none of that ugly, you know, exorcist stuff, you know, none of that. Yeah. I was lucky. Yeah. Um, God, I meant to ask you this, and this is out of the blue, but I got to remember this time. You ever get your saxophone back? <laughs> Because you play, you actually play sax, right? <laughs> Not very well, but um, I'm going to work on it again, yeah. I lent it to someone for a long time, but I'm just getting it back. Yeah, now, uh, you played, what movie was that? All the Right Moves. Yeah, All the right, yeah. football movie with yeah, Tom yeah. Cruise. Tom Cruise, yeah. He wasn't even a big star then. I watch them all come and go and come and go. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Those girls, we sit here. <laughs> One day you'll have to come and, and sit in with the posse. Oh, I'd like that. Yeah, you yeah. play well enough to sit in with Oh, them, yeah, right? sure. This band, this fantastic <laughs> band, yeah. That'd be pretty scary. Yeah. Um, we should tell them once again that the movie opens Friday. Yeah. And it's called Art... What? <laughs> <laughs> Is somebody late for class? <laughs> The movie's called Article 99, and we thank you for coming oh, by. thank you. We'll be right back.